This is Darth Ravage coming at you today with another quick review of a new, very highly anticipated Count Dooku 6 inch uh, from the Star Wars Black series. And I have to say, this guy is awfully, awfully impressive. Uh, this is one of my favorite scenes in Revenge of the Sith uh, where Anakin and Dooku encounter him aboard the chancellor and he's like let's uh, not make a scene here and uh i'm sorry this guy is a scene stiller that was the great late christopher lee that he was either a bond villain he was excellent there if he was saruman and uh you know the lord of the rings trilogy he's a great villain there and he definitely is like one of my favorite villains inside of the star wars uh universe uh definitely in the prequel trilogy he just uh, is there manipulating, undermining, and, and carrying out, you know, Palpatine's, Darth Sidious's plan, you know, all the way through and through. Uh, the one point that I did absolutely lose it was Yoda actually confronts Dooku at the end of Attack of Clones. I totally lost my stuff there. You have to forgive my... Uh, <laughs> Poor Yoda stand in is it's the goofy little Yoda that they released at the beginning of uh, or the first release of uh, Yoda. I don't know if there's not been another release of him yet for the Black Series, but uh, yeah, I just I love reenacting scenes and whatnot. The one thing is, is that Anakin sitting there laying with his Vader arm or whatever as a little stand in there. I don't think I actually got the Anakin just yet. Um, I'm gonna have to get a hold of that Anakin and then reshoot this scene or reshoot this video review. But this is all about Darth Tyrannus, also known as Count Dooku. So let me pause again and get Yoda off screen there and the other people and focus on the meat and veggies of this review. Give me just a moment. First thing uh, I do believe that George got absolutely positively right was casting Christopher Lee as Count Dooku. This is one of the most pretty, <laughs> uh, the I guess that photo real stuff that you could ever have uh, for anything for the Black Series. Uh, let's just take a look closer here as you look at his head. I mean, that's Christopher Lee and all of his lightness there. And I love how in him being Dracula and Scaramanga, I mean, the look and everything is there. And uh, so like, being Count Dracula, he's got a very Count cape for his character in Star Wars. It's an absolutely beautiful uh, soft goods that they added to it. I love how they has uh, they have fast fixed it to his. Uh, ooh, the camera's going crazy. They have fixed the cape and the soft goods there with the chain in the chest and where it wasn't it doesn't like just flop around or anything i love the way that the saber pegs into his uh hilt or the hilt pegs into him to recreate the look from the movies uh he has all kinds of great stances that he can get into as count dooku and uh most of the time whenever he's not being his you know, legendary Sith bat of the bone self. He's just walking around just like you see right here in this action figure. This is just a really excellent piece. Uh, and I love the scene where he goes up and he goes, as he's squaring off with Yoda, he goes, this contest can't be cited with our knowledge of the force, but only with our skills of the lightsaber. And he goes and grabs the, off his belt his curved edge lightsaber. Now that is that there is a thing of beauty. Uh, really did love that whole scene where he ignites it. And then salutes his former master. At this point I was totally losing it with this guy. 
uh, definitely one of my favorites. But what Hasbro has done with this figure, and as you can see, if you look just off to the side there, I've had the other pieces like in and out of the video there. He comes with his regular saber, his saber hilt there, uh, the figure itself, and he also has another thing that makes it look like he's wielding the thing in real time. Surely Hasbro could have done better, or my stop motion work could do better, but anyway, you get the point. This figure is just spectacular. Again, with this figure, I think that Soft Goods is an absolute big plus. He has lots of articulation to get in many different poses, however you see fit. These are just a few of my crude poses, and then why uh, I need to keep practicing posing figures. Uh, but uh, as far as this figure goes, Count Dooku is simply one of my favorite Sith Black Hench figures. He actually took it away from Darth Maul. Darth Maul has been my long-standing favorite Sith, and uh, this this just takes the cake. So my final thoughts on this figure. Uh, if you get a chance to snag this guy, do not hesitate to get a hold of him. He is a really great representation of the Count for the Black Series 6 inch line. i uh, just like to take this time to also once again thanks to thank my friends at Comic Envy, uh, Ryle, Nick, uh, Allison, and Charlie. Thank you guys so much for working with me. I think I had Charlie hang on to this one day when Ryle and Nicky wasn't there. Uh, Allison was there the next day when I went to pick it up before they made them shut down their doors to the general public uh, because of this crazy COVID crisis that we're in. But this has very much <laughs> lightened my uh, last purchase uh, before they get things going again. Get Once everything passes and they get reopened, this is my last purchase from Comic MV over on Merriman Avenue. And uh, just thank them again for always working with me, hanging on to figures that I'm interested in. And uh, hopefully I've done them some uh, good props there with my quick reviews and uh, getting their name uh, in here. And just thank you again, guys, for always being patient, allow me to make payments and, and, and let me get some of the coolest swag I've gotten. If it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't have half of everything I've got. Transformers and Star Wars and other uh, Marvel's Legends. So, again, if you get a chance, go visit their link down in the description there below. Also, don't forget to hit my Patreon. I uh, got it up and running, sort of. And then uh, it, every bit helps that way. And uh, smash that like button. Help me continue to grow my YouTube channel. Please subscribe. Smash that subscribe button uh, if you haven't already. It goes a long way to, to make things a little easier uh, to, to, to make these awesome videos. And again, thanks again to Comic Envy. Uh, really, really love this figure and uh, I'm glad that they held on to it for me and let me come back the next day and get it. And uh, that'll do it. I'll do it for Count Dooku here. Uh, if you like this video, let me know below there. And uh, thanks again for those who subscribed. May the force be with you.